I have made tutorials for custom balls and playing workshop maps with friends, but what about custom decals? I still get people asking all about decals, so this tutorial is a deep dive into everything you will need to know, not only to apply custom decals, but to make them yourself and even write your own texture files. So here's a basic overview of what all you're going to need to get a custom decal to work. You'll need a custom decal PNG, the chassis, and a texture file. You'll also need Bacchus Mod with the Alpha Console plugin. If you don't already have Bacchus Mod, go to BacchusMod.com and click the download button here. Once that's going, go to the plugins page and download Alpha Console. It should be right here on the first page, but if not, just search Alpha at the top. If you're looking for some cool decals, you can download free ones right here at VideoGameMods.com slash Rocket League. I'll have the link to this in the description, but this page has tons of decals for all kinds of cars. I've shown this website before for ball textures as well as workshop map texture files. Once you find the decal you want, scroll down and download it from the blue button here. Now you should have a decal in your downloads. If you made one yourself, then you should have that PNG. We're going to go ahead and load up Bacchus Mod. From this screen, you'll click File and then open the Bacchus Mod folder, then Data and AC Plugin. Here you're going to see all customizable textures for Rocket League. Click on Decal Textures, and at the top of your File Explorer, click on the File Path and Control-C to copy. Next, we can open a new file library, go to Downloads, click on your new decal, and right-click to extract it to our Decal Textures folder with Control-V. With your new decal in Alpha Console, you can launch Rocket League, press F2 to open Bacchus Mod, and we want to relaunch Alpha Console. To do this, go to Plugin Manager and uncheck Alpha Console. Just recheck it after a few seconds. Next, we press F5 to open Alpha Console. If you see this message, it just means Alpha Console has an update, but you can hit Disable Safe Mode. We'll go over to Cosmetics and scroll down till you see Custom Decal. Click on the drop down menu and select your new decal. If you're having problems seeing the decal, be sure to use a car with no decal in your garage and ensure you don't have a decal override through Bacchus Mod items. What if you want to make your own custom decals like mine? To start, you'll need the files for a custom decal. I have all of these files in Discord labeled for Octane, Finnick, and Dominus. You can scroll down to custom decal forums and find all of these files pinned at the top along with tips for writing your own texture files. After creating your custom decal in Photoshop, you'll need to make a new decal folder. Open Bacchus Mod and go to File and Open Bacchus Mod Folder. We'll go Data, AC Plugin, and Decal Textures. Here, create a new folder and give it an easy to remember title. Place your new decal template along with a chassis and skin for your car. You're only gonna need one more thing and that's a texture file. You can do this right on your notepad from your computer and don't freak out if you've never written code before, this is extremely easy to do. On the first line, we're gonna do an open curly bracket. On the second, we're gonna name the decal, so in parentheses, give the decal a name. Close the parentheses, colon, and another open curly bracket. In the third line, tab over and in quotes, body ID, one word, close the parentheses, colon, and we need to get the body ID. Go into Alpha Console. Under decal, you can see current body ID. Leave a space and type that here and finish with a comma. Next is the skin ID, so in parentheses, skin ID, and leave this as zero. We don't have a decal on the car, so the texture file will be written as zero. Next, we need to identify the chassis. So in parentheses, chassis, colon, and another open parentheses. Then diffuse, and try not to misspell this, it's going to be the file name of the chassis in the decal folder. Mine is an octane, so that is oct underscore chassis. Close the parentheses and add a closed curly bracket and a comma. Finally, we need to identify the body skin and decal. So body, colon, and open curly bracket. Again, we do diffuse, and inside this bracket, you'll type the name of the decal file you created. This will overlay the decal on the car, so in parentheses, name of your decal file, dot png. We can close this and then add a comma. Then we need our skin file, which is just oct underscore decal dot png if you're using mine. Finally, we want to close all curly brackets, and that is it. You can save this and add it to the decal folder. Name this file, and at the end, add dot json. This will turn a text file into a JSON file to run in Bacchus Mod. Now that your decal is complete, test it out in Alpha Console, and you're all set. If you run into errors, let me know in my comments or use my Discord. That link will be the first one in the description. You can create a new forum post or see if anybody else has had a similar problem that we've already solved.
If this worked for you, please be sure to leave a like and a comment below. I'm going to be giving a lucky commenter a custom decal every month for the next year. Thanks for watching and check out some of the other videos for more Rocket League customization.